There's no way. I don't, I personally, yeah, don't even condone men moving into another woman's house. Yeah, no. Yeah, buy your own place, guys. Move into your own place. Even if you don't know about move into your own place. Do not move into a woman's house. Yeah? So you do not take your satchel and go and move into a woman's house. No. Yeah, I don't, worst case scenario, worst case scenario, yeah, maybe like a joint mortgage or joint rent or something like that, yeah, best case scenario, have the woman come move into your house, whatever, really. and it, it's not to be a bully or control the dynamics or you live under my roof, so you will, yeah, do what I say, but you, when I go, you know what, I, I go to my mum's house, yeah, I go to my mum's house, I don't have a room in my mom's house, yeah? As I said before, half an hour, 45 minutes ago, yeah? I, when I go to my mom's house, I sleep downstairs on the sofa bed. My mom bought me a sofa bed, yeah? For when I come home, yeah? When I'm home, I sleep on my mom's sofa, and the last time I was there, it resonated. I was like, yeah, imagine I lived in a house with a girl, and she decided to kick me out, yeah? Whatever. They yeah, put ultimatum on me or whatever, innit? Kick me out or whatever, innit, yeah? I'll be back here on a sofa bed. No private room, you know. Nowhere to, yeah, when I come out of the shower, I want to moisturize myself other than the fucking bathroom behind the door. No private room, you know. I'm going to be sleeping on my mom's fucking sofa. That is your, that is your alternative that is what's going to happen to you if you move into a girl's house, yeah? There's going to come a time where she's going to test the strength of a man, the pull back, she's going to kick you out, yeah? Where are you going to go, fam? Where are you going to go? Sometimes, yeah, when you see stuff as a kid, right, and you laugh it off, yeah, and you think, ah, oh, sometimes you have to just take some of that stuff in, but you're a child at the time, yeah? But certain time, or a certain time when you're an adult, you've seen things when you was a kid and you just laughed and whatever in it, yeah? But then, yeah, in late years to come, you're like, fucking hell, there was a man on my road, yeah? Him and his wife used to yeah, the, yeah, get into arguments, whatever in it, yeah? Round up! Let me in! Literally, the man used to be standing outside the house on my road, yeah, a little cold sack that I live on, where my mum still lives now, yeah. Rona, let me in! Rona! It's midnight, you know, 12 o'clock at fucking night, yeah. People are trying to sleep, yeah. But, but fortunately for us, we're in a, in a house with a roof over our head. The man will be... Guys, I will, be, I will look out my window, yeah, at like 3 in the morning, and the guy is standing up outside the house. Yeah, like obviously most normal houses have a little shelter thing, yeah. And they used to, we have the little fences between each of the houses, whatever in it, but we have the little shelter. So if it rained, you want to get rained on, yeah. That's his that's his shelter. Rona, let me in, Rona! Calling the woman's name and she don't let him in the house. She's not letting him in the house like a fucking dirty dog. That you moving with a woman, that is your alternative. Yeah, she's gonna kick. She she she'll probably kick you out. You might have an argument, whatever in it. Yeah, you're gonna have to leave. What are you gonna do, you... guys? You live in a house with a girl. Yeah, you move in with a woman. Yeah, you got two options. She's either gonna kick you out. Yeah, you know you have to leave. Tell you to get out of the house. Yeah, or she's gonna emasculate you. Yeah. She can say to you, okay, get the fuck out of my house. What are you going to do? If you, you live with a girl right now, yeah, or imagine a girl that you are seeing or whatever, or you've dated in the past, just put yourself in a position, put yourself in a scenario right now with someone familiar that you know, yeah, whether you dated them before or you're dating them at the moment. Imagine you're living in their house. Yeah? She tells you, get the fuck out of my house. Yeah? What are you going to do? You're going to go or you're going to stand there with an angry look on your face and say, no. I'm not going, no, like a little fucking, a 10 year old, yeah, when, 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 the, when the kid's parent, when the kid's mom says, eat, eat, eat your fucking vegetables, no, I'm not doing it, yeah, what are you going to do, what are you going to do if your girl says to you, get the fuck out of my house, piss off, you're going to stare at her with a mean look on your face, 
I say, no, I'm not going. Make me. Pack my clothes for me. Yeah? And then <laughs> the girl will fuck you get the laundry bag. You know them laundry bags, them old school laundry bags with the stripes on it and shit like that. Like, imagine an IKEA bag. You ever been to IKEA? You get them big, massive blue bags in there. Just imagine one of them checkered um, laundry bags. You're going to be out on the road. Yeah? I don't know. Where you, where you going to go, fam? It was Salvation Army. Where are you going to go? Homeless shelter? Where are you going to go? Your mum's sofa? Are you going to go and sleep on your sister's sofa? Your auntie? Those are your options, fam. Those are your options. If you meet with a woman, there's going to come a time where she's going to say, get the fuck out of my house. You're going to have a di disagreement more than likely. Yeah? It's either that or you're going to be walking on eggshells. Yeah? I, I, I know, man. Yeah? Couple man, yeah, they used to be players back in the day, innit? Yeah, and I know I don't think it's because you know they've matured and they're like, you know what, I ain't gonna be playing the field or nothing like that. Yeah, I think it's because I can't mess this up. When a man gets into that mindset of I can't mess this up, or else I won't have a home to to go to, then you've automatically given the woman some power because now. You're thinking to yourself, like, boy, it's almost like being at work. It's almost being like, 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 like being at work, having a boss, having, you know, being employed. If I mess this up, I might not have employment. I might not have a house. Once a guy thinks that I might not, I can't mess this up. Yeah. You've already shifted some of your power to the woman. Yeah. Now, the mindset a guy should have is, you know what? I'm 32 years old now. I'm not going to be playing the field. I'm just going to be committed to my woman. Yeah. Monogamous. Yeah. I'm not going to be out. Yeah. I ain't going to have no bike. I'm going to be checking no other girl in it. Yeah. That, that, that's okay mindset to be in. Yeah. Like, oh, all right, cool. I'm going to be faithful. Yeah. Not because I'm scared or anything, but I, you know what? I just want to respect the woman now. Yeah. I fucked around too many times or whatever. And I'm just going to respect this woman now. Innit? But if you get into the mindset, oh, oh I'm going to, I, I can't mess this up because I'm, I'm going to be out on the street. Yeah, I might have to go to the Salvation Army or go to my mum's house or my sister's house or my auntie or my grandma's. Yeah, if I fuck around that, I, I have to be on my best behaviour. Once you get into that mindset, you're walking on eggshells. Yeah, you're skating on thin ice. Yeah, and a woman, remember women, they have six senses. Yeah, they can pick up. On, on that weakness, yeah, on, on, on the fact that you're intimidated or your alternative of having to go somewhere else, yeah, and that's when women get the power, yeah, that's when you're no longer, yeah, up here and the woman's down here, yeah, and when I say woman's down here, she's not a piece of shit, it's just you're the superior, because men were supposed to be superior, isn't it, yeah, I mean, let's make this thing clear right now, yeah, men and women were equal in the outside world, yeah, in, in a conversation, at work, yeah, yeah, we're equal, that's cool, isn't it? In a relationship, men and women, we're not equal, yeah, we're not equal. The woman's not a piece of shit, yeah, but we're not at the same level, yeah, I'm the superior, yeah, I'm not saying she's the inferior, but I'm saying I'm the, in, I'm the superior, yeah, we're not equal in relationships, yeah, out in the outside world, if you're, if you've got a female friend, yeah, your guy watching this right, you got a female friend, yeah, you two are equal, yeah, yeah, you should never see your friends as subordinate anyway. That's that's not right. Yeah. My 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 man them, yeah, my man them, they're all on my level. Yeah. Yeah, I might have more money than them or they have more money than me, whatever, but we're all at the same level, yeah. Respect them. Yeah. So yeah, you got a female friend, you're at the same level. But your missus, no, she's not at your level. Yeah. You're the, the superior. She's not necessarily the inferior, she's not a piece of shit, but you are the superior. That's where you're supposed to have it. Man like Justin back in the Ross Clark building. Come on, fam.